Well, hey folks, I just wanted to take the time today to make a quick video about uh, taking care of your acoustic guitar. Um, this here is my Martin, and unfortunately, because I let the humidity get too low, uh, I developed a back crack on my beautiful guitar and uh, had to take it to the Martin factory and get it repaired. Um, I don't know if it'll show on here, but the back crack was right here. It was about from here to here. It wasn't real tall, but it's enough to put the fear of God in you when you find it. So, uh, Martin repaired it for me. Uh, I bought this guitar used for $2,900. Um, so I'm not the original owner, so I actually had to pay for the repair. Um, but, um, it cost me $284, well worth the money. The uh, It probably didn't come through in the video, but I can tell you that the repair is absolutely invisible um, so anyway the problem with the guitar was that the humidity level was uh, way too low and the guitar was very dried out um, as a matter of fact I had bought a humidifier after I dropped it off at the factory and um, it, uh, it actually reads the humidity and the temperature level in the room and the room only had 27 percent humidity um, one of the things I learned at the factory is as you're in the waiting room, they have a big screen TV that, you know, cycles through various parts of the factory. And it also shows you the temperature and humidity level in that part of the factory. And uh, the temperature was always around 70 degrees and the humidity level was always uh, approaching 50%. Um, the repairman told me that, <coughs> excuse me, you want to keep your humidity level between 40 and 50%. So anyway, my video today is about how to achieve that. And um, one of the uh, systems he recommended is the Oasis system, which I have here. So I want to show it to you because I think it's uh, way better than some of the sound hole systems or the Herco clay, clay box. Um, this system sits in your strings. You can see it right here. Um, and you fill it with distilled water. And what happens is, as the water evaporates, the water can't get through this other than any other way than evaporating. This will actually crinkle up and shrink, uh, letting you know you need to add more water. Um, these, this comes separate. You got to put this on here, and then you just separate your D and your G string, drop it in, and let the strings hold it in place. The particular model I bought, I bought a package came with the humidifier and a hygrometer. And that hygrometer right now is reading 70 degrees and 45% humidity. Um, I think combined it was something like $48. It also comes with this handy dandy syringe to help you add the distilled water. Um, now you have to use the distilled water because you don't want water with any, uh, um, you know, magnesium or anything like that. And it's salt. Um, but you simply drop this into your distilled water, pull it out. And uh, I take this out of here, open the top, and drop it in until it's full. To close the top, put it back in, and drop it in the case. So, in any case, uh, like I said, I, I had an, uh, an, a humidifier for the whole room, as I have other guitars. But where I live, I have to use a water softener, which requires salt. And what happens is, is as that humidifier atomizes the water, um... I began to notice a very, very fine film uh, developing on just about everything in this room, so I had to stop using it. Um, I began using tap water because I was putting a gallon of water plus a day in the humidifier of distilled water, and it was running into a lot of money. So, I mean, if you got the money to use distilled water all the time, I guess you're not going to worry about that. Um, but I actually had to clean tubes out of my amplifiers, the tubes, everything. I had to spend almost a whole day seriously cleaning the uh, film off everything so I'm um, really glad I decided to go with this system which was a whole bunch cheaper than a, a full room humidifier anyway um, you can buy the Oasis humidifier that just sits in your strings I think they're fifteen sixteen dollars if I ended up buying a package but uh, for the other guitars uh, I think I'm just gonna buy the humidifier you can buy this for your electric guitar as well. It can sit in the case wall, you know, over in here or over in here on your electric guitar. It attaches to the wall with a clip. I have this one attached to my uh, to the 
to my case well and um, just a little bit out of the way so it don't hit the neck but uh, I, I think this is a really good system it's cheap protection and you're never gonna have to come home and find your guitar with a crack in it and uh, you know almost give birth um, I freaked out um, and had a fairly expensive repair um, $284 is a lot of money to pay for a repair but you know this guitar retails now for close to five thousand dollars and uh, it's just a great guitar so it was worth doing so anyway that's my video uh, I urge you all to check out the Oasis humidifier package and uh, make sure you have it at least in all of your acoustic guitars uh, talk to you later